Hello, my YouTube friends. Welcome back to my channel. So today we have another very exciting Hermes unboxing video. As you see, I have a few orange boxes here with me because a lot of you guys are curious about what else did I buy or what else did I recommend from Hermes so that you can kind of start your Hermes journey. So today is the day. I just got all this uh, different amazing goodies from my sales associate and I'm just going to unbox one by one and show you how I usually build up my Hermes journey and what I purchase usually before I get offered a bag. Okay, let's start from the smallest item. And by the way, I just noticed like the ribbon that they have for 2022. It's so cute. See, like it is very special because like what I usually get from my sales associate, it's just like very standard Hermes ribbon. But here it says Hermes 2022. And also in addition to all the horses that they usually have on their logo, they also have like, I don't know, like a Superman. Look how cute it is. Okay, so this one is actually the lip gloss that they just introduced this year. Oh, look at how cute is the packaging? So the color that I got is, I believe is number five. Yeah, so as you see, like the color here is rose cola um, and the number is number five. So my sales associate highly recommend this color to me. She said this one is the cutest color and a lot of people uh, recommend this color after they got all of them. So look at the packaging. I know some people are complaining that it might look a little bit cheap, um, like some lip gloss that you can buy from CVS. But to be honest, it's quite heavy. So it's not made of plastic, but the, um, the packaging is actually made of glass. So let me just open it up. Oh, okay, let me just try it on my hand. Oh, so it is very moisturizing. It might even get a little bit sticky when you apply it to your skin, but it is really moisturizing and you see like this shining texture to the lip gloss. And I think this is a very natural color and then you can pretty much wear it every day. Even if you're not with any makeup, I think you wouldn't go wrong with this color. So this is really cute. Okay, I really, I just can't wait to try it. Really like it. And this is, yeah, number five rose cola. Okay, let's move on to the next item. Um, why don't we, you know, do this? This one is, I guess, the most expensive out of everything that I purchased today. Um, again, like it comes with the same really, really cute ribbon. It's really cute. And to be honest, like I've been eyeing for this. Okay, let me tell you, this is a jewelry. And it is a ring. Um, and you see, like, I also have my, you know, wedding band from Hermes. And I love, I, I definitely absolutely love this ring. And, but for this ring, I'm thinking about, you know, wearing it on my index finger. So can you guess what this is? Ta-da! Oh my gosh, how cute it is. Okay, let me just take it closer so that you can look at it more closely. So this is the D uh, anchor ring, I believe. Cor uh, just, you know, pardon me if I just got the name wrong. Um, but this is the D uh, anchor ring that they have in the rose gold color. Let me just take it out. And I got it in size 51. I'm not sure whether you can see it. Yep. And hopefully this is the right size. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at it. How gorgeous it is. The reason why I bought it, because I feel like it looks very similar to the Love Ring, right, from the Love Collection in Cartier. And I think this is just like perfect index finger ring. And it's more about like, it's not fashion jewelry. Now I'm more and more into like the fine jewelries. And because this is in rose gold, I think it will be a great addition to my current jewelry collection. It's like for the rings, I believe I only have it in platinum or in white gold. So yeah, this is really cute. I can see it matching really well with all my other, you know, rose gold jewelries. So yeah, I absolutely like this one. It's really cute. What do you think? I know there are a lot of other designs that are more popular these days, but um, me personally, because I also tried it in the store, I feel like this one is more versatile and also it feels more comfortable on your finger. I don't know whether I'm a little bit bloated this morning, but uh, it seems a little bit tight, but I don't feel anything. 
I think this is a really cute ring. What do you think? Do you like this one? Okay, let's move on to the next one. Um, actually, I bought two, and as you see from the packaging, it is the a plate from the uh, Mosaic collection. So let me just open one up and show you how it looks like. Every time I look at their packaging, I'm always impressed because they did such a fabulous job packaging all the goodies. Um, and for this one, because it is from the Mosaic collection, it's really popular and super hard to get. So let me show you um, what it looks like. Ta-da! Oh my gosh! Yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. Look at all the details. For the Mosaic collection, it comes in two colors. One is this one, the silver color, and the other one is the gold color. I personally like the silver color better because I feel like this is more perfect for the summertime. And if you remember this, you know, every time you walk into an Hermes store, they sometimes have this on their floor. So I find it really interesting and you don't need to use it as a sushi plate because I think that's how they call it at Hermes. This is uh, technically a sushi, uh, sushi plate. Let me just take it out and show you like the details on the side and on the bottom. Um, take a closer look here. Oh my gosh, this is a, a lip. Um, what I heard is, you know, for every plate, um, you know, like the craftsmen who build it, they just like leave their little stamp that represent that this is produced by them. And um, so every single one is different. And I really like, I think it's really cute that, um, you know, like that craftsman like chose the lip to represent him or her. Um, yeah, and you don't need to use this as a sushi plate because come on, who eats sushi at home? Or maybe like, all right, maybe you can do takeout. But for me, I'm planning to use it as my jewelry plate. So for example, I'm just going to put it at the door and every time that I come, you know, back home or, you know, like I can just easily take off all my jewelries and put it there. I think this will make it a really, really cute, you know, accessory plate. And it the plate itself, because of all the details, I feel like it's just such a pleasure to look at it. And pricing point, this is also really reasonable. I believe it's retailed at $190. Um, yes, I just checked the receipt. So it is $190 US dollar. Um, so I think it's really something worth getting from Hermes. And just for comparison, I also got this other sushi plate from my trip in Paris. So this is from the A Walk in the Garden collection. And I believe the price in Europe is even better compared to the US. I think it's like 130 euro, if I remember correctly. So I think both of them are super, super cute. And for the Walk in the Garden, it's pretty low key. I would say like you wouldn't notice that this is from Hermes unless you're an Hermes lover. Um, but I feel like they have different styles. I like both of them. Um, I feel like this mosaic collection is more sophisticated. Well, this one is more fresh and I think it's more young. So what do you think? Which collection do you like better? Do you like the mosaic collection or do you like the walk in the garden? Just comment down below and let me know. All right, my friends, that's it for a very quick and small unboxing from Hermes. Let me know if you enjoyed this type of unboxing video. I know you all want to see handbag unboxing, but I know some of you guys are also curious in, you know, like the Hermes journey and also recommendations of what else that we should get from the Hermes store, you know, besides bag or before you get and buy a bag offer. So I hope today's video will be helpful for you. For those of you who are interested in exploring other items from Hermes, and if you like today's video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will definitely upload more unboxing videos and fashion and jewelry or handbag reviews in the future. So thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.